Next, we will talk a bit about route groups. So we will use route groups to create a simple FAQ uh, to answer questions that happen outside of the main conversation flow. So what I mean by that is that the main conversation flow we see here, which is uh, we start, then we ask for the name, and then we ask if they would like coffee, and then about the breakfast. But imagine that you went into a coffee shop or you called a coffee shop. It's just natural that you could have additional questions before you're able to continue um, finalizing your order. So for example, you could ask what type of coffee do you have, what types of drinks, what types of food, etc. And this is uh, the exact uh, good use case where we can use route groups because we will just uh, need to define those cases once and then we can reuse them in several places of the conversation. So let's kick it off. Uh, we want to use route groups, which is essentially another type of state handler to handle the transition uh, of a state inside of a page. And we need to check this one here and then this option will appear, route groups. And now we can already create a route group. So let's call it uh, breakfast FAQs. And these will be our frequently asked questions during the ordering of the breakfast. <clears throat> and now we can go and add routes. So I will add two routes for now for the example. Uh, one will be about uh, the breakfast options. So what's on the menu? Let's, let's call it uh, what's on the menu. And then this will be one example training phrase for this intent inside this uh, route. Uh, what, and then we can order. We can <clears throat> we can add some other examples like what type of breakfast do you offer? And then we can also add what type of uh, food do you offer? Or we can just say what do you have? Or what do you offer? I think these should be enough for now. Let's save it and. Um, hit save on the route as well. One note here is that after answering the question, we could now add a transition also to have this thing from the last video where we just um, give a hint, give an answer, and then we reprompt the last question to really make sure that the user absolutely does not get lost. For example, if they if we just ask them if they want to order coffee, then they ask us what type of coffee, we could redirect to the uh, coffee page here. However, that is then a hard-coded transition and we cannot reuse this in several places of the conversation, which is why I'm gonna leave it open. And I will, in case you didn't understand it, I will demonstrate what I mean in just a second after adding a second FAQ, which will be, um, do you offer delivery? Um, and then this will also be an example training phrase. Do you offer takeaway? And uh, yeah, so this should be enough for now. I'll uh, add uh, con condition true here and we'll add also the answer which I, by the way, forgot in the other, other route, so I need to go back. And the answer to this will be, uh, sure, we offer a takeaway and a delivery option. Uh, and then we'll just uh, give some more info and say you, you can choose, you can specify this after uh, finishing your order. Let's just say that. So I'm gonna go back to this one and add the answer also. So the question here was what's on the menu and we'll just say for now, we are just starting this shop. Uh, for now we only have black coffee and 
let's say toast with jam and butter one basic type of breakfast so now we have added this route group here to the coffee page and like i said in the beginning it's about reusing we can easily reuse it so i can now add the same route group also here never forget to hit save because otherwise it's gone and i can also add it here in the name step so now that this is all set up let's try it hi what's your name uh peter would you like some coffee and then i'm gonna ask what type of coffee do you have and then since i added this i think as an example phrase now we can see that it says exactly it gives me the information about what type of breakfast is on offer and i can now now i need to remember what the question was like i said the reprompt here is a bit more difficult if you have any idea on how to reprompt again to ask if they would like coffee let me know in, a in the comments for now i'm gonna say yes coffee please and then i'm gonna since i added the route group also to the breakfast page where we are at now I can say, I can ask, um, do you offer delivery? And then we can see that it went into the same um, route group and hit the other FAQ intent. And it gives me some information on, the, on these options. And finally, I can say, <laughs> what was the question again? Would you like some breakfast? Yes, I would like some breakfast. And this one, I didn't understand, so let's just say yes. Uh, and now I seem to be lost. So where are we now? Flow, no flow selected. It seems like now we dropped out of the flow. Let, okay, this is going to be interesting now. Uh, do you offer delivery? So the route group is still hitting. And then but the rest is gone. So something went wrong here. I don't know what, but I hope you got the uh, the gist of it, which is you can create route groups and reuse them in different places of the conversation without having to recreate your intents, recreate your routes, and add them to different pages to answer any questions outside of the main flow, and then you can, can go back easily to the main flow, except in this last case here, where it just didn't work, and I'm gonna to try to find out why not.